I first got into the sport about 16 years ago. Uh, a friend of mine um, had signed up for the London Triathlon and asked me for help and support with his um, cycling and running. He was already a, a pretty strong swimmer and, uh, and I went and supported him and uh, I thought I'm going to have a go at this and 16 years later I'm, I'm now coaching the sport. Uh, and what made you get into coaching then? I worked for the John Lewis Partnership and uh, going into the uh, London Olympics they had a four year uh, programme to support people that wanted to get into sport or if you're in sport to support you in coaching and I was very fortunate that they uh, funded a lot of my um, coaching courses that I um, wanted to do. And uh, what bit of advice would you give an athlete uh, thinking about going into coaching or taking up coaching? Coaching is a fantastic uh, way of giving back into the sport. Um, dip your toe into it to begin with um, to see if it works for you. But the piece of advice I'd give is you can't race and coach at the same time. Uh, you need to decide and uh, you're coming towards the end of your coaching ambi uh, sorry, uh, racing ambi ambitions, then by all means uh, have a go at coaching, uh, but try not to balance the two together. What would be your favourite quote uh, that you'd be using? Oh, my favourite quote? Um, that's, that's a hard one. Um, I, I do like the one um, that uh, it, it doesn't get easier, or it doesn't get harder, it just, get, it just gets easier. Um, my coaching philosophy when I first came out here was to help people to develop as much as possible. It's not so much those um, with ambitions, it's, I, I always like to support those that have got a, a high performing mindset, and that doesn't mean to say that they're going to get on the performance on the podium every time, as long as they want to work and develop and, and achieve. And how do you feel that you've uh, developed that own, create that philosophy and that ethos within Try Training Harder? Within Try Training Harder, it's working with um, the different testing uh, elements of each discipline that I've learned and try to uh, develop those for not only myself in terms of a learning curve, but to support the athletes at the same time. And how would you say, how would you describe kind of your favourite athlete to work with if you could describe them? Wow. <laughs> um, as long as an athlete is prepared to work and, and wants to achieve, but at the same time challenge me as a coach to find different ways to help and support them, either through coaching or mentoring, I'm happy to do either for 